The surface of these plastic dishes have been chemically modified so that only part of each surface interacts with water. In this video, I will show a simple way to modify certain surfaces to achieve this effect. I will also discuss some of the chemistry involved. The chemical treatment process is remarkably simple to carry out. A sticker is placed on top of a petri dish. A device called an Alden coil is used to treat the exposed surface of the dish with an electric corona discharge. The part of the dish exposed to the discharge is chemically modified. The portion of the dish covered by the sticker is not. Now that the dish has been treated, let's remove the sticker and see what happens when we add water to the dish. We note that water adheres to the treated portion of the dish, but does not adhere to the portion of the dish that was protected by the sticker. How does this experiment work? Well, let's talk about some of the chemistry involved in this experiment. We'll first take a look at the Alden coil. Notice that sparks emanate from the tip of the device when it's turned on. It's easier to see these sparks when the tip is placed near a metal object such as these tweezers. The plastic dish used in these experiments is made of polystyrene which is a substance that is made of only carbon and hydrogen atoms. Compounds made of only carbon and hydrogen are called hydrocarbons, and hydrocarbons do not mix easily with water. We can see this effect occurring with the water on this dish. The water does not adhere to the dish, but rather beads up. This is because the water is not attracted to the dish, which is comprised of a hydrocarbon. Treating the dish with electric charge causes oxygen in the atmosphere to chemically react with the plastic in the dish. As a result of this reaction, oxygen atoms become inserted into the chemical structure of the polystyrene. As a result, the polystyrene is transformed into a molecule that is no longer a hydrocarbon. That's because it contains oxygen atoms as well. These oxygen atoms on the new molecule can attract water molecules through hydrogen bonding and other forces. This means that water should behave differently on a dish that has been treated with electric discharge as compared to a dish that has not. I'm going to go ahead and add some water to this dish that's been treated with electric discharge. Sure enough, the water seems to adhere to the surface pretty well. Let's compare this to a dish that has not been treated. Sure enough, the water beads up on this one. It does not adhere to the surface well at all. To finish up, I'm going to show you this experiment from start to finish. I'm going to try to do this with a heart design with a little flower inside. Do you think the surface treatment will be able to pick up the fine details of this design? Well, let's find out. Okay, let's remove the sticker and see if this worked. Alright, moment of truth. Add a little bit of water. Hey, it looks like it worked pretty well. I'm not sure it got the little flower though. Let's add just a bit more. Perfect. Well folks, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed learning a little bit of chemistry with me. Please do consider subscribing. Thanks a lot for watching.